If the pandemic has given us one thing, it is the ability to work remotely. With this new part, Project Agha aims to introduce an all-inclusive curriculum where the students are taught practical skills and knowledge that can help them navigate this new world. its establishment in 2018 project agha has been striving towards the upliftment of marginalized communities by stimulating action oriented and practical knowledge among our beneficiaries many around the world have struggled during the height of the pandemic the sudden transitions between online and offline mode has created a knowledge vacuum bachcho ke school band ho gaye hain classes band ho gayi padhai To tackle this project, Agha moved towards a virtual training space. Workshops were conducted with organizations such as Santa Brigade, Gandhi Pengio, Connecting Dreams Foundation, Gargi, and more. Our educational sessions covered a wide range of topics, from sustainability to mental health. learning and repeated diluted syllabus have become so deeply ingrained in students that interactive methods are virtually unknown according to the pratham only 40% of our 14 to 18 year olds are capable of calculating the price of a shirt at a 10% discount fewer than 60% can read an analog clock these statistics and the pandemic provoked us to start the project aga fellowship program Through it we aim to uplift the students by teaching them practical subjects amiss in school curriculum. The fellowship targets foundational aspects of learning through six course pillars: verbal and analytical reasoning, financial literacy, technical skill training, civic and environmental awareness, personality development and entrepreneurship studies. The curriculum is effectively backed by subjective expertise from our knowledge partners at Accenture Tata Motors and Teach for India. Brainstorming sessions on the development of our curriculum and screening of our fellows helped us form a route of learning that goes beyond the textbooks. Project Agha's approach to the fellowship is pan-India and non-discriminatory, welcoming 25 students from all walks of life into a safe space. To kickstart the teaching and learning process, experienced teacher volunteers were scouted and were trained by accomplished Teach for India fellows. Collaborations with Delhi University societies such as NSS assisted us in ensuring deliverables to the students. The current cohort was selected based on a screening test that assessed basic general knowledge, mathematics and logical reasoning. post which stationary items were delivered to the homes of the selected students as a welcome kit to the fellowship program it was then that project agha's fellowship program was officially launched in the presence of our knowledge partners fellows team members and teacher volunteers itc's corporate social responsibility head mr sanjeev goel motivated them to unleash their hidden potential the comfort of our fellows in an online setup Ice breaker sessions were organized coupled with the establishment of a buddy system during the classes various topics were first handedly introduced such as equality human and child rights entrepreneurship etc hi my name is kalpana kumari mujhe fellowship ki class bahut interesting lagti hai kyunki hame hai main class mein kuch naya seekhne ko milta hai jo aage jaake hame bahut kaam aane wali hai Moving forward project Agha aims to expand the existing fellowship model by welcoming a larger group of students with regional diversification expanding into a boot camp model for children from all backgrounds however our endeavor to be the change makers in testing times didn't stop there as virtual mental therapy vmit project agha's second vertical prioritized taking care of the mind in tandem with the body We collaborated with certified practitioners like Mrs. Ruchika Kanwal and Ms. Chinnar Kapoor that encouraged discussions on sensitive and relevant topics like body positivity and navigating relationships. The seminars drew a huge audience and were received with appreciable feedback. Till date, Project Agha has impacted 520 plus individuals, educated 500 plus children, youth, and women through its NGO workshops and VMED sessions. 
been fundamental in the creation of three youth entrepreneurs with 25 more students in the making through our fellowship program. We have set out to make SDG 4 and 3 a reality. An act this Karki aims to make its beneficiaries self-reliant and sufficient in an era characterized by uncertainty and disruption. This is Project Aga. In 2020, the novel coronavirus wrecked havoc across the world. It brought along with it a plethora of socio-economic problems, the biggest of which was global unemployment. According to the International Labour Organization, global unemployment reached an all-time high of 207 million in 2022. In India, the Centre for Monitoring Indian Economy reported a staggering unemployment rate of 7.91%. Thus, a multi-level project became essential to bridge the gap between India's dire unemployment situation and the untapped potential. This school of thought led to the inception of Project Vikas. The word Vikas literally means growth, progress and development. With these as our core ideologies, Project Vikas started as a one-stop portal for providing upskilling opportunities, training and employment opportunities for young adults higher education students and the educated unemployed by providing them with the means to overcome the intellectual and creative blocks being faced by them. Project Vikas was awarded the best collaborative ideas in the Inactus Cares Ideas for Impact competition. The project aims to connect the opportunity provider with the opportunity seeker by creating a digital marketplace for job and career resources. In the last few years, Project Vikas has become a platform that empowers people to grow, develop entrepreneurship values and have the resources to create a tangible impact. In the past year, some of the major initiatives taken by Project Vikas were The Project Vikas Internship Week, an idea that aimed to source internships to students through exclusive collaborations with companies. Aim to provide a platform where our target communities can find useful resources in the form of video lectures, blogs, skill building courses, information regarding new job and internship openings, new industry trends and work from home employment opportunities. The idea became a reality as Project Vikas began to shortlist and get companies on board from diverse industries. The event was a week-long venture that witnessed an immense number of registrations. With a 35% conversion rate across 250 applications, the Internship Week became a highly successful program that provided 60-plus internship opportunities to the participants. 12 organizations looked over 250 applications, with the highest stipend reaching Rs 18,000 and an intrinsic monetary value of the overall fare reaching Rs 3,75,000. Along with this, the Internship Week included four unique webinars that specifically focused on career building and CV enhancement, all of which were attended by an overwhelming number of more than 800 students. Ending with webinars that upskilled the students and made them industry-ready. Project Vikas organized the very first B-Plan competition and a series of boot camps from knowledgeable speakers to help budding student entrepreneurs innovate, grow and compete in the professional world while also bringing tangible changes in society. The three insightful webinars by three well-known persons in the entrepreneurship circuit gathered hundreds of registrations across India. The boot camp consisted of three webinars, namely Entrepreneurship 101, Execution 101 and Investment Pitch 101. Alongside the series of insightful webinars, the business plan competition aimed to create opportunities for aspiring young entrepreneurs. During this experience, they learned how to develop skills in pitching their business ideas to an experienced and esteemed panel of judges and received constructive feedback. Moreover, the B-Plan competition boosted ideas that framed their business concepts around social change, empowering those in need and creating something for the greater good. 
prizes up to rupees 20000 were awarded the final winning teams of the competition were the first position we moves business plan revolved around setting up the world's first open source 3d printed wheelchair hey team luai darwaza wala you are from team we move it was amazing taking part in project uh, vikas at enactus kargi uh, it's only through these competitions that uh, new entrepreneurs like me get a chance to network with serial entrepreneurs and vcs and receive feedback on our business ideas and uh, receive mentorship uh, aligning with project vikas's core values of spearheading social change this truly captured the essence of what the b plan competition and enactus kargi is all about In the near future, Project Vikas aims to focus on the skill development of the underprivileged community. Our beneficiaries would include school dropouts and students from rural backgrounds. We will establish a monthly revenue generation model through course and internship collaborations, which will help to provide the adequate supply of funds for the development of our beneficiaries. Project Vikas will provide them with aftercare learning in the form of upskilling programs such as digital literacy, spoken English, base level corporate qualifications, etc. With the help of digital footprints, Project Vikas will be introducing core college educational content on its YouTube channel through collaborations that bring home opportunities to our target audience. Building a community lays the foundation for successful collaborations. With an aim to partner with 80 plus organizations and facilitate engagement through a digital footprint of 170,000, Project Vikas projects to create a community of 500 plus individuals who are mentored and impacted through the offline project model and bring a tangible change to India's youth mindset.